Assalamu alaikum. This is Anmol Sheikh and my ambassador is Amna Suhail. Today I am going to discuss a topic about oculomotor nerve disorder. Oculomotor nerve is the third cranial nerve. It originates from its nucleus at superior colliculus level of midbrain, enter the orbit through superior orbital fissure and innervate the extrinsic muscles of eye. This is the pons and this is the medulla oblongata. The connection between the pons and medulla is called the midbrain. In the tegmentum part of the midbrain, the nucleus is present of the oculomotor nerve. Here the nerve is arises and then it passes from the cavernous sinus and then it passes from the supraorbital fissure and then enter into the orbit. Enter into the orbit and then divide it into two parts, superior and inferior. Superior, superior supply the muscles of the superior oblique, superior rectus and levator palpebri muscles. And inferior nerve supply, the inferior branch supply the ciliary ganglion, inferior rectus and inferior oblique muscles. Here the ciliary ganglion is present. Ciliary ganglion supply the ciliary muscles. Okay. Third cranial nerve is, arises from the tegmentum part of the midbrain. Then it passes through the cavernous sinus. Then the supraorbital fissure. And then it divided into two branches. Uh, superior and inferior. And then in, enter into the orbit. It, superior supply the superior oblique, superior rectus and levator palpebri muscles. And inferior supply the inferior rectus and inferior oblique muscles. And the ciliary ganglion is present which supply the supply to the ciliary muscles. Oculomotor nerve function. Oculomotor nerve supply the pupil and the lens. It innervate the upper eyelids and it innervates the eye muscles that allow for visual tracking. Oculomotor nerve disorder. Oculomotor nerve disorder. Oculomotor nerve disorder when the cuts when the nerve supply cut off from any part any region which I told you and any region and the damage to any nerve or muscles that they innervate can cause diplopia. Damage kisi bhi Nerve ka kisi bhi part se damage ho jana ya pe cut off ho jana jo hai muscles ki innervation rok dega. Jab muscles ki innervation nahi hoki to wo different situations kaim karenge. Different symptoms aayenge patient ko ki diplopia ke symptoms aayenge aur bahut si other symptoms aayenge. Aur agar nerve supply cut off ho jayegi to phir impair kar dega. It impairs the ocular motility and the pupillary function. Wo causes. The causes are vasculopathic disorder. Vasculopathic disorder means heart disease means when the patient suffer from the heart disease or the diabetes, inflammation or infection, 13% it causes the oculomotor nerve disorder, trauma, due to any trauma, congenital due to the, congenital is due to the increase in the intracranial pressure during abryological level and aneurysm. The symptoms are the diplopia, tosis, paralysis of eye and the pupil is expanded. Diplopia is the condition of the double vision. Patient is Patient is unable to see proper or the, and patient or patient ke false images banenge. Ek true images or ek false images. This ke through patient is unable to see Tosis. proper. Tosis is a condition of the droppy eyelids. When the levator is kept, when the levator palpebri muscles is weak. So it causes the tosis. Means the eyelid is going to be weak day by day and and eyelid become droppy at certain age. Prices. Prices is the weakness of the eyes muscles. Patient is unable to move their eyes proper. Pupil dilation. Pupil dilation means the pupil is going to be dilated. And you can see the normal eyes. There is a dif you can see the difference. The all these eyes clearly you can see the difference. Treatment. Treatment can be both surgical and non-surgical. Surgical treatment, partial or complete surgery. Non-surgical treatment, non-surgical treatment or modalities are not much helpful. Surgery, surgery remain the main stay of the treatment. Means surgical treatment jo hai aapka last option hota hai. Non-surgical treatment agar aap karwate hai to aapka itna fayda nahi hota, aapko itna beneficial nahi hota. Isliye non-surgical treatment jo hai wo itna helpful sabit nahi hota as compared to the surgical. Surgical is more, more, more suitable for that type of person. Thank you so, thank you so much for your precious time. Hope you like the video and hope for the best.